and welcome to the vlog. It's a little backwards how I'm doing this today. I've got, uh, this is my intro, it'll also be my outro, just so I can uh, kind of sum everything up. I know it's a short vlog, I just want to get some things out there, because uh, there's some good progress that's been going on, but I don't want to let this drag out for three weeks before I get a video up. So I wanted to take the time to do it now while I don't have much going on. Sod came in on all the pallets, here's some clips. Oh, Sod came in, it's pretty nice. So much over there. I got uh, pledges from the frat coming on Sunday. Uh, so two days from now, Friday right now. And we'll take a few hours. If we got 30 guys all putting down sod, it could go pretty quickly. So hopefully around like two hours or so of setting that up and get it all done and in place and then have, have a lawn in a couple weeks that I can walk on. So looking forward to that. See you guys in a bit. Other than that, since I've been in my boot and been injured, I've been working away and uh, working on some artwork to get that done. So here's some progress on this big wall that I've been making. The wall started as styrofoam, um, well, a giant sheet of plywood, and then I cut out styrofoam bricks. Um, I glued those to the wall, and then I covered them with drywall compound. Um, once I was done, I was able to uh, find some spray paint that looks like stone, so I used that to um, spray over all the, all the blocks, and then I used some gray spray paint to uh, put in the grout try to make it look like more of a brick wall and then I just made a giant stencil here's the small version of the stencil testing it out um, went to FedEx blew it up into the giant sheets and then um, cut that out to make the big stencil to use for the wall to get this result other than that I had pledges come in on Sunday and we put down all the sod Super happy how the sod came out. It's uh, so nice to see, so nice to have a yard so I can walk around. Just looks nicer. Everything about it is pretty nice. So, uh, super happy to get that done, and it's so satisfying just to see an instant lawn. Uh, if it was grass seed and stuff, I mean, it's, it comes along eventually, but it takes weeks for it to grow and be good enough to actually do anything on. So, to have an instant lawn is so just satisfying to see. On that, I've been doing a little bit of throwing. Um, just some drills with the boot on just to try to uh, stay in shape, work on the finish of my throw and keep, keep working. Also hit another PR and bench. Um, I was trying to be explosive with some pad bench, but I got uh, 200 kilos for five. Um, it's 440 for five, and I was just trying to move the bar fast. Let's go now. Three weights. Come on. Let's go, Jordan. Let's go, Jordan. Come on. See strong. Come on out. Oh, oh. Come on, there you go. Two. Up. Nice. Let's see three. Two. Up. Up. One more. Come on. Up. Let's go. Feeling strong, and it always helps to throw far when you're feeling nice and strong. And also, Meg got into her master's program for athletic training, which is super awesome for her. She's been stressing out and worried about that a bit, but 
uh, super relieving for me to for her to get into that. So awesome that she did that. Uh, super proud of her and working her ass off, and uh, definitely showing me how how much homework you can do sometimes if you're <laughs> grinding it out. Because I I cannot study like she does sometimes. It's insane. All right, Meg, you've just been accepted into the UVA Masters program. Uh, tell tell me a little bit about how you feel. I feel great. great. I am very excited, and I don't know. I'm happy. <laughs> Bye. And for me, as far as my ankle goes, I've been progressing nicely. It's been feeling pretty good. Um, when I'm at home, I take my boot off and I can walk around. I can put some weight on it. And even when I was putting down sod, I didn't have my boot on just because I had actual boots on, so I didn't get uh, all dirty and my feet wet. Um, but I felt pretty good. Uh, I, I walk around, it was a little sore, and I was like limping a bit. But even since Sunday, it's now Thursday. It feels a lot better so I think I'm out of my boot tomorrow I've been just going to rehab doing exercises trying to ice it keep it elevated take a leave um, just everything I can to get back so hopefully I can be back soon I don't know the time frame from when I get out of my boot to when I can do full throws um, or if that's just different for every person so it, it's really hard to say but I'm just gonna keep doing rehab I'm gonna transition to an ankle brace being that and whatever I can do I I can do so I'll just try to work into it slowly and get back I don't have a meet for like two weeks so I'm just gonna take my time and over the next two weeks just try to build back up and get back into full throws and hopefully crush it this year and throw some bombs well I figured that this is a pretty short vlog I haven't actually edited and put the clips together yet but there wasn't too much going on in the last week um, just some thing things around the house some different landscaping stuff and I mean every, everything that I just talked about so Thank you so much for being here if you made it to the end of this vlog. I will be back soon and hopefully I can get some throwing progress, some other progress throughout my life and just hopefully do some fun things. So I'll see you guys in the next one. Have the best day ever, the best night ever. Take care of business, get things done. Smile and go far. See ya. Dude, you know what's not going to be a winner? Oh, I think he is. Oh! Oh, yes, sir.